slumdog millionaire tells the story of a poor boy who goes on a game show in order to reunite with his long lost love. The movie's a favorite of critics and it's already won four Golden Globe Awards. You are on your own, Jamal. <sighs> Hello? And joining us are director Danny Boyle and screenwriter Simon Beaufoy. Mm -hmm. You guys both won Globes Monday, Sunday night. Yeah, we did. Does it yeah. all seem quite real yet, or...? No, I keep waking up in the morning and staring at the statue thinking, thank goodness it's still there. <laughs> expecting <laughs> to take it away again. Again. <laughs> Here's, talk about an interesting and unlikely pair. Screenwriter, most famous for The Full Monty, yeah. about people taking off their clothes. <laughs> <laughs> all right. And director, most famous for Train Spotting, a movie about heroin. I know. And you get together, and this is this wonderful, gorgeous, heartfelt, beautiful story. Well, it, actually, I remember The Full Monty, and it was one of the most warm, inclusive, you know, uh, pieces of screenwriting I'd ever witnessed in a, in a, in a cinema, you know? Mm -hmm. It's really include. it didn't exclude anybody from right. the experience, and that's quite rare to find, you know? And yet it's also very honest about people's lives. Yeah. So there's this good combination then. So you come to the uh, 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 novel Q&A. That's right. You have the kind of sensibility just described. But what did Danny do with what with your work? Because it's so vivid. Is it almost documentary-like in some points? Well, there are, there are, look, there are some directors who shoot your script, and then there are, once in a blue moon, a director comes along like Danny who makes it fly, and you can just feel it in the film the energy of that city, Mumbai. Yeah. It's got amazing energy. And Danny's the most energetic director that's ever lived. <laughs> had you, you, had, had had you ever been to India before? No, I don't, no. That was my first time. I mean, I, I, I read his script and I was just like, ah. Oh. You, you could feel the city and I got there and it was confirmed by being there. Yeah. It's like New York. I mean, it's not like New York. Right. It doesn't look like New York, but the energy on the streets is like New York. Phenomenal. It just Everybody's on the come. Everybody's trying to get someplace. Everybody's Every doing bits of business right. at all different levels, mm -hmm. you know? There's mm -hmm. this kind of vivacity in the city. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's like New York. It grabs you by the throat and says, you'll never be the same again now. All right, there are people sitting in a <clears> home <throat> saying, why on earth would it, I ever want to go see this movie? Just put it in a little capsule. Story of a boy through horrible circumstances ends up on this game show. Why should we care about it? I think it's because it's a story about hope, really, at the end of the day. And right now, when financial markets crashing all over the world, this is a film about someone who goes on this show that's all about money, you know, who wants to be a millionaire. And actually, he doesn't even want to be a millionaire. <laughs> he wants to find the long lost love of his life. So it's a story that says money isn't the most important thing in your life. Right. And right now, that seems like a good You're message. You're emotional just talking about that. I do, honestly, I do. <laughs> <laughs> so you find this story with amazing heart. You have to shoot it in one of the most challenging places to make a film <laughs> anywhere. What was that challenge like for you? Because these scenes, there's no studio. You're on the streets of Mumbai. Yeah, we wanted to do it like that. They were surprised because in Bollywood, they normally, they make films in studios only. Right. They don't make them on the streets. But we tried to make them in, in the real places every time, you know? Yeah. Amazing film. Congratulations. And we'll Thank keep you. our fingers crossed for you with the Oscar nomination. Thanks, Harry. All Thank right, you. Danny Boyle and Simon Boyle.